Hey guys, it's me again. Just thought I'd talk to you about something else for a minute. Um, another topic that's on my mind. Been on my mind for a long time, really. Um, it's the issue with weight. And it's a three-letter word that people use a lot. Fat. She's fat. He's fat. Well, they must be fat. Or there's some kind of weight uh, comment involved. Oh, well, she must be anorexic. He must be anorexic. Is he anorexic? Oh my god. Let me tell you something. This is coming from a person who's probably been underweight for a majority of your life. I was not anorexic. My body burned fat at a higher rate. And I see some of these comments that people make about uh, Sean Johnson and how she's fat. That's not fat, people. That's muscle. You realize how much energy it takes to keep that muscle tone for that matter? Um, and just how stupid people can be when they see somebody that's a little bit different looking. Not every gymnast is going to be a tiny little thing like Dominique Mochiao when she was in like the 88 Olympics or 94, I can't remember which. She was part of the Magnificent Seven and she was part of Belly, Bella's Girls. If you, if you know gymnastics, you know who I'm talking about. Not everyone is going to look that way. There are other gymnasts that want to look better than little tiny dolls and Sean Johnson and Christy Henrich are among them and unfortunately they're criticized because of their weight issues muscle weighs more than fat probably two times as much if I remember correctly if you see somebody that looks fat you should really honestly keep it to yourself there's no reason for you to say anything to anyone about it it's their body. It's not your body. What are you doing with your body? What have you done with it? Are you fat? Do you have too much muscle? Do people call you fat? Inform them. Let them know. This has been a problem for a long time. and Unfortunately, it cost Christy Hamrich her life. I had a chance to meet her uh, when I was volunteering Special Olympics helping out. Um, we chatted for a short time. Unfortunately, we lost track of each other. But this isn't what that video is about. This is about people not wanting to see people as being different. People want to always go to the assumption is either they're fat or they're underweight, they're anorexic or they're bulimic or they're whatever the case may be. No one's perfect. You're not perfect. I'm not perfect. So anyone who wants to start using the fat word should really look at their own waistline first. What do you look like? How do you feel when you walk? Can, can you walk up a flight of stairs without getting tired? If you can't, I don't think you have any reason to call anyone else fat. That's just my opinion. Thanks for watching.